Hello, everyone, and welcome to Life Stories. Today, I'm going to be your host, Dr. Dennis Humphrey, and I have an amazing guest with me, Bishop yes. Leonard Lacey. Uh, we each have a life story, and with that life story, there's a, there's a message that we can give to others. And so today, we're going to talk to Bishop Lacey about his life story. And ideally, it's going to align perfectly with life stories because it's going to assist others, not only in their own lives, but hopefully bridge some gaps. So welcome, Bishop Lacey. Thank you, sir. Dr. Humphrey, I am blessed to be with you today. And uh, yes, I have published a book in regarding a portion of my life, and it, I believe, gives a story that, um, that as we go through life, we have the opportunity to share what we've learned uh, that others might prosper from that. I believe it's important that we share from generation to generation. Excellent, excellent. Now you mentioned your book that you wrote, and I, th and I believe, and of course they can see it here, Life on the Highest Plane. So how did you discover your own journey? What brought you to write this particular book? Well, experiences that I had okay. through life. Okay. And from those experiences, I believe that uh, it has caused me to understand life a little bit better. And okay. I think it's also important that we share that with other people that they can avoid some of the pitfalls in life. Okay, excellent. You know, and I do want to hear more because I, I was talking to you earlier, mm -hmm. and you mentioned that you had started Unity Institute. Yes. And so now, given that you've spent, I believe, 33 years in the Commonwealth of Virginia and the Virginia State Police Force. That is so right. how do those two tie together? Well, I um, had a desire to be in law enforcement from high school okay. and um, had the um, privilege of joining the state police back uh, in uh, 1976 and grew out of that experience uh, of seeing life at different stages and people going through different experiences and then being called into the ministry is what led to this book. So you said 1976, that makes you 22, right? Well, it's close <laughs> to that, close to that. No, so 33 years in Virginia. So yeah. d are you a native to Virginia? No, I'm originally from Alabama. Uh -huh. um, my parents moved to Virginia in 1971. Okay. I had to spend a year with my grandfather before uh, I moved up. Uh, so we've been here ever since. Okay, are there other resources that you have available? I mean, is Life on the Highest Plane your only book or? What other things would you offer to our listeners that would help them achieve a relationship with God? Well, I have written a number of articles uh, for the newspaper. Okay. Uh, I have also a weekly uh, radio announcement um, segment linked to life, ah. uh, trying to inspire in a one minute segment something that can empower us. Uh, okay. I have written uh, other books as well. Okay. Well, let's, let's talk back. Let's get back a little bit to your life story. So, well, when you started, you know, how did it end up that you're now Bishop Lacey? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> um, I started um, preaching in 1988. Okay. And it's out of that experience trying to follow the Word of God, uh, mm -hmm. listen to the Spirit of the Lord speak to me. Okay. Uh, and then be able to uh, present that to uh, the listening audience or to our church congregation. And okay. it's from that we begin to... Uh, see the strength and weakness in, in each uh, person yes. and trying to give answers to some of the problems that we face. And it's okay. out of that then we begin to uh, realize that everybody has potential. Okay. And with that potential, <laughs> if we can share with others, it will hopefully cause them to avoid some of the pitfalls that come with life. Well, I should have talked to you about 20 years ago, but, yeah. <laughs> but, but since we're just meeting now, you know, uh, I, I, I do, don't want to miss this part, but I know that part of your journey had this wonderful person with you. Yeah. So would you like to share some about her and who she was? Oh, sure. <laughs> her name is Dr. Renee Lacey. She passed uh, two years ago. Uh, just a dynamic woman of God. Uh, she was uh, director of alternative and uh, summer school program with Prince William County. Uh, she was a gifted woman of God. She was a musician. She was a teacher. She was a, uh, a preacher. She. Um, uh, just gave me a wonderful life, uh, and unfortunately, she passed uh, uh, two years ago. Okay. And um, it's from that teamwork mm -hmm. um, that um, we have uh, four uh, grand boys, yeah, okay. uh, two daughters, and a son, <laughs> okay. and they're okay. all in ministry with us as well. All in ministry. All in ministry. All yeah. in ministry. Yeah. And, I, and she must have been wonderful because as soon as you started talking about her, you lit up. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, it, you're also doing some additional things, right? Aren't you with Stafford County and some other things? What, what are those? 
Yes, I work with uh, the Stafford County Sheriff's Department as a chaplain, also okay. U.S. Okay. Department of Drug Administration okay. as a chaplain as well. And like I say, with the uh, link to life that we um, foster every week. We open up a unit institute as well. Okay. And the purpose okay. of that institution is to give individuals the opportunity to learn yes. uh, spiritually as well as from their experience and then go out and apply that as they walk uh, in life daily, regardless of whether they're in ministry or not. I love that combination, institute, meaning learning, but then unity, bringing everyone together. Right. And I like that common purpose. That sounds amazing. And, and I'm hoping that we have an opportunity to speak more, but because we're close to ending this segment, okay. what I do want to do is thank you so much for joining us today and sharing part of your life story, because I know there are a lot of our listeners who are going, who are going to gain benefit from that. And oh, by the way, they'll get to read Life on the Highest Plane. So with that, it's my pleasure. I'm Dr. Dennis Humphrey, and on behalf of GTV, Fox 5 Plus, have a great day and share your life story.